Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Extra, Extra Large With B Dozen yeah, This is how I do when I'm repping hip hop Ladies and gentlemen, tuko na Q-Chief Savimbi Abu Bakr Shaban Katwila akiwa na Ramadhani ya saba siku ya leo ya tarehe ngapi vile leo tarehe 23 Mei ndio eh leo Ramadhani ya saba leo ya saba au vipi tarehe 23 Mei tuko na Q Chief Savimbi siku imekaa kinyonge kidogo kimaumivu kidogo sababu kaka yuko tayari kusema bye bye kuhusiana na game ya mziki wa kibongo inasikitisha kidogo au vipi hata leo tutajua sababu Ah uh, yeye yeah, kuamua ku pull out you know I'm saying wakati game ndio inalipa sasa hivi game ndio imechangamka you know what I mean lakini so, chief, karibu karibu kwenye microphone na, na, na wakati huo huo feedback kwa sababu si mara ya kwa I mean uh, si I speak leo kwa mara ya kwanza akisema anaacha tayari ni kama siku kadhaa kwa hiyo huenda kuna watu tayari wamemwambia kitu ambacho huenda kikambadilisha mawazo so yote tutafahamu leo sisi kama team double excel hatukubali kio chief kuacha game Yes. Sisi kama yani au mimi kama mimi. Mimi siwezi kuruhusu chila kaa hapo boss wetu. Ah, kitu boss kabisa eh. eh. Vizuri bwana Msofe. Vizuri sana. <laughs> bwana Kichif, wakati Kichif anakaa hapo Double Excelinian, ndugu yeah. yangu tulia nimweke kwenye mood sababu leo sitaki mtu alie. Unajua akili amefungua. Hawezi kujua kutoa machozi ni, ni, ni umefungua. Hawezi eh, kulia. Ni kweli, ukilia umefungua kama sababu. Sasa mimi sitaki aliye. Anaweza. Unafikiri kitu kidogo? Hawezi kulia. Hii game imemunite na watu wangapi? Wewe usingemjua mimi nisingemjua nobody ambaye angemjua unajua. Yeah, na hii ni talent yako nayo sauti nzuri kabisa. Mimi naamini kwamba ikifika time unaona kwamba hapa basi inawezekana hapa basi nifanye vitu vingine. Mm. Lakini kiu chief bado yuko fresh bado kabisa. Kenya unajua kibongo bongo ndo wasanii wadogo wadogo kina yang kila kila ya kina yang di yang di sio dogo janja madogo madogo unajua lakini kwa wenzetu wote kina nameless bado wapo kina watu ni wakubwa lakini still bado wapo kwenye game sasa Q chief sababu hasa ni nini my brother karibu kwenye show sikuje tena kuaga sio utakuja siku nyingine wale ndo mwisho inauma hii mambo ni mengi hata tujitahidi karibu kwenye show bro asante sana asante sana kwanza kabisa napenda kusema rada Ramadan Karim. Naam. Kwa Islam mtu ambao uko kwenye mfungo. Lakini niseme asante kwa Clouds Media Group. Ah uh, Excel na vipindi vyote. Mali na Ruge Joseph Kusaga Johaini ya mama. I just want to take this moment kuzungumza na Watanzania alikuwa maamuzi rais alikuwa maamuzi magumu na nimekuwa nikifikiria mara nyingi sana lakini siwahi kutoa tamko rasmi mpaka pale ambapo nilikaa chini nikasema maybe this is the right time mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah what mm-hmm. makes you what make you feel like this is the right time unajua nimepita madaraja mengi sana katika maisha yangu na kati naanza nilikuwa na ndoto nifike mahali niwe kama wazangu ambao sasa hivi wanafanya vizuri lakini on the way nikakutana na majaribu ya kibinadamu ambapo nilijikuta nimeishia sehemu ambayo siwezi kumlaumu mtu yote isipokuwa mimi mwenyewe na siku zote nilimwomba Mungu anipe 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 ile stara ya kujua makosa na mapungufu yangu ambayo 
nimeyafanya katika dunia hii unaelewa eh ukweli ni kwamba mmeshirikiana na mimi vizuri tangu mwanzo wa safari tangu kutoka uchumi you been supporting me you been there tumefanya mambo mengi sana sana ya historia nzuri ambayo mpaka leo mimi nina kumbukumbu ya baadhi ya vitu no. lakini katika safari yangu nakutana na visiki nakutana na obstacles barriers lakini pia nakutana na hukumu ambayo inani hukumu kutokana na mapito yangu mm-hmm. sio ilifaa kipindi sikutaka kuwa a prison of my past mm-hmm. i just wanted relief kwa sababu nikitazama macho ya watoto wangu naona maumivu na machozi na madeni naona kabisa nina madeni ambayo siwezi kuyalipa kutokana kwamba siko kwenye system na siko kwenye mzunguko siko kwenye rotation siko kwenye dunia ya kawaida ambayo wenzangu wapo kwa hiyo ile lazima nikae chini nijitafakari na kujitathmini na nijitafute kwamba of all the mistakes that i have made wale amna hata mtu mmoja ambaye anaweza akaangalia kwamba chief ni kama Saida Karoli tu ambaye alianguka pale na Ruge Mutaaba akamchukua mpigania akamchukua tena akaondoka naye I saw that I've seen Ruge taking people from down taking them to the top where they didn't have any destination mm-hmm. imetokea baada Saida nimeona nilikuwa mwanza mkamuita and now she has a platform she is doing good mm-hmm. and I'm happy kwa sababu niliangalia nafasi ya Saida hakuna mtu mwingine ambaye anaweza ku replaced hata kama mtamtengeneza nani mm. there she is mama amekuja sijui umri wake lakini mimi ni mdogo zaidi ndio lakini she is doing good na mnampanga fanya hivi piga na huyu piga na huyu so mimi nilikaa nikaangalia nikasema labda makosa ambayo nimepitia yanania vipi so leo niko hapa sitaki kutoa blame kwa Klaus FM Klaus Media Group kwa Joseph Kusada au Ruge this is my own my own fault i made this decision kwa maamuzi yangu mwenyewe kwa kuona kwamba I've been a failure to my life, a failure to my family, a failure to my kids. Na jina la ubini wa Kiu Chief Abu Bakar Shabani Katwila linaathiri familia yangu, linaathiri watoto wangu shule. So you can understand the pain that is going is going around me. Which pain? What are you talking really about? Yeah. Before jenda kwenye hiyo pain mchongo na namrudisha Kiu Chief uh, nyuma kidogo. Hii si mara ya kwanza Kiu Chief unatangaza kwamba unaacha muziki. Imekuwa ni umeshawahi kuzungumza tena kwamba unaacha muziki kama miaka miwili nyuma iliyopita na sasa hivi unataka tuichukulie umedhamiria au ni tangazo kama yale matangazo mengine ambayo yalipita kabla hata ile la mwanzo alikuwa tangazo kwa sababu kwanza nilikuwa kwenye frustration time na nilikuwa kwenye kipindi cha mapito ambacho nilikuwa bado natumia drugs lakini nikaona kwamba unajua kuna ile kwamba unataka kushindana na ukweli kwamba you are in, in, in a situation if you are not if you don't care mm-hmm. what people are telling you So ilivyokuja ile fikra ya kusema kwamba naacha it was just a mind lab na ilikuwa sehemu ambayo usipo sawa lakini ikafika kipindi ambacho I was trying to push myself kutoka hatu mmoja kwenda hatu nyingine ya 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 ya, ya, ya kutoka kwenye transition ya changamoto kuja kwenye recovery wakati nasema kipindi kile nilikuwa nigo and drugs mm-hmm. lakini when I went out katika effort zangu mwenyewe itiada zangu mwenyewe sio kutolewa kwa watu ambao nyinyi mliwapigia kelele wa mwatoe na wamerudi tena na tena na tena na tena na kufanya makosa yale yale tena na tena na tena mimi mm. niliingia once na nikatoka once na nikaja nika declare kwamba i confess kwamba niliwahi kutumia kwa sababu nimepitia 1 2 3 lakini natoka kwa sababu kuna maisha baada ya mziki i have my dreams nimepita tu kwa njia ambayo inaniukumu leo na kesho you got my point mm-hmm. again, right? so This time around wakati nimesema nilikuwa na rasta nimekaa nilikuwa naogopa kumwambia kwa sababu asingeelewa nisingemshauri nisingemshirikisha mtu yoyote labda familia yangu au kitu gani lakini nimepita into situations ambazo nikiangalia in my life that's not you chief kwa yale mapito na maumivu ambayo nimepita najaribu kusema nimekuwa shujaa wa nafsi yangu mwenyewe kuipigania all those time but i just needed somebody just needed somebody ambaye Some, some, somebody who would show that kwamba okay wewe umekosea unajitambua na unajua your mistakes how well screwed in ndani ya siku moja how well kujitakasa kwa sababu kweli which is true you will have to go this through this process upitie hii haya maumivu ambayo unayapitia mm. ujifunze so nilipokuja kukaa chini nika realize kwamba of all the things that i'm going through mungu anajaribu kunipa ujumbe kwamba 
umeshawahi kukaa chini kuniomba mhm mm ni Mungu ambaye sifumbi macho mi ni Mungu ambaye macho yangu yako open na tazama watu wote lakini ukimlaumu dazen ukimlaumu mami baby ukimlaumu suka si sudi you don't have rotation na nini umekaa chini kuniomba mimi hata siku moja usiku ukajitolea raka tatu tano ukakaa chini kuniomba nikajigundua kwamba nilikuwa na mapungufu mengi sana mhm najua masingira makundi malezi mimi nimekuwa superstar na miaka 19 i don't know anything you understand mm -hmm. that I'm surrounded by people with different purpose you are talent yangu so it wasn't easy for me to survive katika msitu wenye chatu wengi na, na kutoka na kuwa mtu sasa sa basi baada ya kugundua kwamba kuna hizo mistake ambazo zimetokea labda kuamka usiku kupiga raka mbili umshukuru ama umuombe Mwenyezi Mungu kagundua kwamba hivyo vilikuwa vifanyiki jibu ambalo ulipata kutoka kwake ni kwamba sasa achana na masuala ya mziki then uende wapi ufanye nini what's the plan acha sikujua naenda kufanya nini tena kwa sababu nilisema tu kwamba sitaki kuwa mtume wa vitu yako nataka kuvua huu mziki wa mziki ambao nimejitwisha na unanielemea ambao ni mziki basi kama naidhalilisha bongo flavor maisha na yoishi it's not true ngoja nikupe mfano mmoja kuna ambao ushapitia kwenye matumizi ya madawa ya kulevya my brother from another mother i'm not sure kama yuko tayari nimeshe ni hapa au vipi yupo mjama fulani yeye ame struggle for 15 years yani 5 years ya ya kula madawa 5 years ya kukaa rehab na another 5 years ya kuprove kwa watu kwamba hii kitu sasa nimeacha yani kujitakasa ile kuprove kwamba ameacha lakini mjamaa yupo na hapati pia rotation za hivyo lakini yupo na anakomana kufanya mziki vo hivyo mdogo mdogo watu wanaanza kumuelewa wanasahau ambao amepita na maisha yanaendelea kwa wewe kuacha mziki unafikiri itasaidia nini sasa kurudisha uaminifu kwa watu ama rap au labda umekuwa kama mzee Yusuf sasa sasa hivi umeamua kuwa shekhi na dila dini una swali na kumrudia Mwenyezi Mungu moja kwa moja mambo ya dunia utak tena mzee mze Yusuf au Somali Yusuf speaking of mzee Yusuf na Somali pia. Somali yes. Yeah. Mimi nadhani mzee Yusuf na Somali wao wamefanya maamuzi sahihi na ni mazuri sana. <laughs> Lakini mimi si 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 kutaka kurudi kwenye kwenye kuwa imamu au kuwa nasoma vitabu vya Korani na kuwa si mtaani kwa ulimisha dini hapana. Mimi nilichosema tu ni kwamba ili lazima nikae chini na ni muombe Mwenyezi Mungu anitoe kwenye hatua hii na mawazo haya mengine ya ajabu zaidi kuliko kuacha muziki ambao nilikuwa nayo kuliko hata kuacha muziki you can imagine japokuwa ni maamuzi magumu lakini kulikuwa kuna maamuzi mengine ambayo yasingempendeza Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala msingependeza familia yangu yasiangeuza watu kwa sababu ya kufikiri ku commit suicide kwa kufanya vitu vingi sana damu sana na kipindi chote niko naongea na Mungu na mwambia Mwenyezi Mungu sijaua lakini kama hawawezi kunisogeza na watu wangu na mimi nikajisogeza nikajitahidi nikajitahidi situation will go worse and worse and worse so sikutaka kurudi kwenye madawa kwa sababu hata nilivyoingia sikujua nilingeaje mm -hmm. so the other option that i had was like ni tu wewe mzigo ambao nimejitwisha. You understand? Yeah. Na hata wakati nakuja miguu yangu ilikuwa mizito sana. Nimeongea mimi lakini kila ninavyozidi kusogea ni gari. Kwenye hiki kituo ile jengo. Yaani nagundua kabisa there is something missing within me. Yeah, and I am kitu. not Yes. Yaani miguu imekuwa mizito kuja hapa mm. kusema kwamba bye bye ndugu wananchi naacha music. Kwa mm. kweli hiyo sisi hatukubali sababu bado tunaamini una uwezo mkubwa sana na kama Saida Kalori aliweza kushikwa mkono akainuka tena why not kiu chief umemtolea mfano mwenyewe nafikiri jinsi ambavyo unaongea hapa sasa kuna watu wanasikiliza wana wanapata nini cha kuweza kudeal na wewe lakini kama miguu imekuwa mizito kuja mjengoni kusema goodbye for the game of the music tafadhali usiache bado tuko pamoja unajua kitu ambacho pia kinanivunja nguvu zaidi ni kwamba mimi nilikuwa napenda niache wakati sina uwezo wa kuimba sina 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 uwezo 
wa kuimba sina uwezo wa kukonvinsi mtu au sauti yangu haiwezi kukonvinsi au ninachokiandika ni kwamba labda mtu mwingine aandike labda nimepit nime, 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 muda wake ama nini lakini nikaja kugundua kwamba kila nikisikiliza hizi ngome ambazo zinapigwa nikijiweka katikati miongoni mwa wale watu najiona kabisa nafasi yangu na barabara yangu you are there you understand there. lakini i'm demoralized because my past is eating me and people don't want to admit kwamba i have done a lot of mistakes and i'm just a human being extra extra large Play it all that hip hop you crave.